Hi guys, welcome to Lashik's Nursery. I'm May, and I am back on today to um, a well overdue video, guys. I know it's been a couple of months. I do apologize, but you know how life is. We all say it because we all go through it, but I am happy to be on today to show you my completed Katie Marie by Ann Tamerman. I'm gonna put it on the screen right here or in the description because um, I know I didn't pronounce that right. But um, yeah, I'm back on to show you her. I'm so excited. Guys, so much had hit me at once that I just cannot come back on. I actually couldn't even work on this baby. Um, I had to stop and put her down so many times that I was getting frustrated because I was like, I want to have this baby done by a certain time and it just kind of flew over my head. But you know how it is. So, But I'm happy to say nevertheless she's completed now <laughs> and it's been it's been a while but um oh and actually guys i have three baby no actually four babies that is going to be graduating i have a 12th grade um two eighth grade which is my twin girls they're just made 14 and my baby who is 11 she's getting ready to turn 12 but she's uh, graduating out of the fifth grade so yeah i have like graduations right around the corner but i wanted to complete this baby and i knew i needed to get her out but anyway guys enough talking i don't want to make this video very long i will be back um with just updates of what i'm doing and what i'm going to be doing um and showing some of my babies as well because i wanted to um bring harmony and angel love and of course you know of course of course my big girl <laughs> yes Chrissy but anyway guys let's get to this video and I want to do a details video um, because this baby can go home so I'm not gonna say what day it is because I'm sure when you watch this video this baby will be at home with his with her mommy which is at Billy's nursery right here on YouTube go check her channel out guys that is where she is going she has so many beautiful babies and guys, I know it's probably been a lot of y'all getting babies, um, and I will check for that, but I have not been watching YouTube, not because I don't want to, it's just because I've been busy. But anyway, guys, let's get to this baby, because she's sitting here patiently, right? Alrighty, I'm going to start down here with her feet. Um, she has very realistic um, blushing on her feet. That is the bottom. She has a cute little um, broody mark there. There's the other bottom. As you can see, she does have um, nail bits and half moons on her foot. She does have a little mottling. It's probably coming up um, a little darker than what it is. Um, just because she's a lighter baby and I feel like she needed that motion under the skin. Of course, you know I love my veining, guys. On this leg, she also has a little mole there, um, a broody mark. And she also has more veining. Um... This is one hand. I love, guys, how her fingers turned out. They turned out really, really nice. Um, I made her a little bracelet. Actually, uh, me and my daughter, one of my daughters. So, it's a little angel on there. Um, so, yeah, that's her hand. This is her other hand. And um, she has a little mole there, mommy. And let's get ready. You ready to show them your adorable face? girl this is a big baby and by the way guys this is not the body she's gonna be going home and i you know me i love to put babies on bigger bodies but i say you know not all mommies like that but i just bought it just in case you know i decided to go with that but i think she's big enough with the size that they recommended but here she go guys look at her look at that pretty girl <laughs> And um, the coloring is probably coming in and out. This is an iPhone, and you know it kind of shows a little reddish and all kind of stuff. But she is super cute. She has green glass um, eyes, the ones that they blow. Um, so they're the full round glass eyes. My first time using these guys, and I was a little scared because I didn't know that they'd be so thin. Like, they're really thin, and I was scared like that I was going to break them or crack them or something. So anyway, as you can see, she has a cute little broody mark there on her face, like her mommy. And she has um, painted eyebrows. And she has some really cute uh, rooted 
eyelashes they are rooted but I do root them pretty um, thick because it just goes with the theme that I wanted to um, see her with her mom did um, pick out her complexion um, so you can say she was accustomed if you know like I explained in my last video that this was a baby that um, I was supposed to make about I think about a year ago so I was really happy when the mom decided that that's what she uh, this is who she wanted me to do for her and I really enjoy painting this baby um, I love painting the toddlers I think we can give them so so much more personality um, she is definitely my tropical baby <laughs> so um, I hope you love her mom and um, so, but that is her. She has, um, what else can I tell you about her? She has really, really long hair. Um, I'm going to just get over her because she's not really completed. She has this pretty curly um, baby hair. Um, she does have, let me see. Oh, okay. She has sideburns. She is rooted very, very well. She's rooted, um, micro rooted, one or two strains. Um, I did pierce her ears. Mom, she has um, baby hair all around her um, her little perimeter of her hair. Also, on the back of her neck, she also has baby hair. I just thought um, with the mixed babies, uh, biracial babies, they have a lot. They tend to have a lot of baby hair um, all around their head. Um, but you can, you know, just to change that. Of course, she has my little signature vein here. I have to put that vein up there, guys. She is super cute. She has 100% human hair. It's very, very long. I am going to probably trim it just a little bit because I believe she's a bigger baby. And um, just to be honest, guys, as much as this hair costs, I just couldn't see it no other way. I'm like, I'm not cutting the hair. <laughs> but, um... You know, if the mommy, I, I think she'll appreciate it being long because her babies have, um, Miss Billy's babies have long hair anyway. And as you push it up in a ponytail, it's, of course, going to um, get shorter. But I just put these little um, pigtails in her hair. She's super cute, y'all. Look at her. So anyway, um, what else? Oh, let me, mom, this is a modified pacifier. Um, I would suggest the modify. I I am pretty good in um, putting the magnets in babies' um, mouth, who a lot of people say they have a hard time doing. But for some reason, hers I don't know if it slipped. Or I was I did it the same way I always do, but I think it's just the way her mouth is really really made. So it was difficult. But she does have a magnet, mom. You can put the pacifiers in her mouth. Um, if it don't sit well just turn it like just like that just turn it and maybe it'll sit but i will say um the modify i'll send her home with this one and i will say the modified to me works better for her i know some people might say well she's a bigger baby but she's a baby baby like she's a big girl but she's very very babyish if you see her um she just comes off really babyish spoiled <laughs> So anyway, um, Mom, I think this works better, the modified pacifier. It just fits right in. And if you get these bigger ones, it'll sit perfect on her face. But there's her cute little mouth. Um, let me see, is it focusing? Okay. She has two little teeth at the bottom. Um, I didn't overdo the color of her teeth. I just, I mean, they're white, but they're not like overly done. So she has gloss inside of her um, her mouth. Say hi, yo. She has she has gloss inside of her mouth, and um, her lips is gloss, but not overly gloss. And I don't know what else I can tell you about her. She is super cute. Right now she is, um, I think, probably uh, measuring about thirty inches. This body is kind of like she's not even put together. It's just like stuffing, and I just kind of put it like that. But, oh, yeah, and this is the palm of her hand. I think her hands are very, very, guys, very, very realistic. I didn't over blush them, but I put enough blush where just, it, you know, you know they're blush. So, anyway, look at her little fingers. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. Well, 
I am going to end my video here and I just wanted to come back and show you the um, my vision of Katie Marie along with her mommy um, her mommy definitely wanted her to have black curly hair and this um, skin color uh, this would be like the skin color of my um, lighter biracials like I say she's coming off of she's probably a little lighter than what the camera is actually showing her because the blinds are not like super open you know um yeah so that is my version and mommy's version of katie marie and i hope you all really enjoyed seeing her and i thank you all so much for sticking around the people who are still subscribed to my channel i know i'm doing such a horrible job but hopefully i get better i'm working out some things where i could be more um involved with the reborns um and also if anyone got new babies out there congratulations to all the the new babies that has been born um, I did take a glimpse of one or two videos before I did this video and I'm just like holding back the excitement of these mommies that I've seen got new babies especially um, I just had to see who got that um, Claire Taylor um, I think it's the prototype two and congratulations serenity a uh, yes girl that baby is beautiful along with all the rest of the babies but i'll make i'll you know do shout outs and all of that in my next video but i need to get over there and see those babies and also guys thank you so much again for watching my channel coming back seeing uh, my babies when they completed just sticking around for me hopefully i'll do better in the near future she has a piece of hair here <laughs> oops okay Alrighty, guys, say bye bye. See you soon, mommy. Bye bye. Bye, guys. Thanks for watching. Till next time. Bye bye.